Hello YouTube. This is HMS Duck. It's my first commentary. There's a saying and it goes like this. It's better to keep your mouth shut and look stupid than open it and remove all day. And I'm about to remove all day. Over the next few weeks I'm going to be banging some videos up. Trying to create a bit of a channel. Put some commentaries out there. Like I said this is my first commentary. A little bit awkward. A little bit, a little bit uncomfortable but... I'm going to get past that and be able to produce some nice comms even though I've got the worst, probably the worst accent in the United Kingdom but it doesn't matter because one day, one day there'll be somebody really famous with a Birmingham accent that makes it cool. Until that time we're going to have to just put up with me. This is baby buffalo zone here. It's, this map is based deserted Russian office intense interior fighting. Which it is, which people may immediately whip out their shotguns. I'm just like kicking some serious baby buffalo ass there. And then here the footsteps is the turtle beach kicks in. That's nice, gets the first harriers. I think I get three or four harriers, I can't remember. Which I'll tell you now I am an average player on this game, I'm not. I'm not the best player in the world, but I managed to get a decent scoring out. This is about the sixth game of the night. Tonight I decided I was going to put all my soft, software and hardware set up to do this. I wanted to get a video ready. Couldn't get one because the six games I played, say, previous to this, were noob tube fests, as a lot of the games are. But then all of a sudden this game come out the hat. I know that we don't want to win the game. Um, you now know that. <laughs> it, I was in. I do a lot of. I'm not the greatest player in the world, but I do a lot of defensive work. And big mistake here with the Scar Rage. I'm GLing. I'm just terrible with the GL. I'm proud of that. <laughs> it's, a, it's a good thing to be shit at the GL. If you shit at the GL, you should be proud of yourself. Yeah, we don't want to win this game, but. I am tr I'm trying to defend certain flags at certain times. There's a there's a point that we get to where my team do actually play like a team really and they do the right thing. But at the time I thought they'd actually abandoned me. We'll get to that anyway, but when I'm playing in these domination matches now, a lot of the team unless I'm with my friends and we're playing together and you've got people that are going to work together then I'll just come in here I'll defend the flag try and get a few kills and have some fun that'll be it. I'm not going to go and stand on the flag and get shot the whole game it's just rubbish so this game was brilliant if you've got a team if you haven't got a team and everybody else hasn't got a team then you're <laughs> you better just defend and let everybody else run around The minute now, I'm in a, a, this is the point I'm on about. I'm in a bad position, or I thought it was a bad position at the time, but they kept on coming, so I was, I was kind of like milking it a bit here, just trying to to hold them off. Then I realised I was on my own, and I'm thinking, well, fair enough, go for the flags, we need to take the flags, but like, <laughs> don't go just throwing away your flags and letting them chase you around the map. We want to hold them off as well, and they all disappeared, but I <laughs> somehow managed. A little bit of superhero stuff here and all them off because it's a it's a nasty place to come in that door that they're coming in. They they they, they probably know where I am, but that when they look across, they don't know what they're looking at. It's difficult, so it is a good position to be in. And I did milk it a little bit there. A lot of these, everything I'm probably saying, it's already been said before. This game has been beat to death. I've missed the boat with it, but like, Black Ops is going to be coming soon and hopefully we can get some good content. So I've got a few people I want to bring on the channel, a few friends, even some subscribers if I can get in there. A lot of games I'm going to be playing, I mean FIFA 11 is coming out tomorrow, I'm definitely going to try and get a, a video up before the end of the weekend. Maybe a Cubs match and that, so. And a Predator that didn't fail. Something really great about using a Predator Missile, controlling that missile. Lovely little kill streak. This is a nice little kill feed here. Uh, chasing this guy. I didn't purposely jump up this bin out 
I don't know what I was doing, but like it kind of worked out. And then I was like, oh, get shot in the ass, run into somebody. Then I panic, throw a few bitch grenades. The guy's disappeared, probably been shot. And I get shot in the ass, and then I bump into this guy. What are you doing? <laughs> and you get out of it. And I know I'm using AI 12, so you like, it's a great gun. What other gun would you want in that scenario? That's just fantastic. You knows it. Just having a look round here now. Try, trying to protect Alpha. I heard it shouted off. I do try and. It's a bit hard to do it when you ain't got a team with you. But like, you still try and play. 25% the objective, 75% yourself. I know people will hate on me for doing that and domination, domination fans will. It's all I play is domination. But the moment I see that people are not doing what they should do, you might as well just pack up tools. And them guys were just playing Kiss Chase there, trying to get to me, I think. Or trying to get to the flag, should I say. Got the areas up again there. Aries is a great kill streak. Get all oh, that's a nice headshot. Happy days. I use the FAMAS a lot. I also like the M16, a lot of the burst shot weapons. Rafi Cat on its own. Not Akimbo. I certainly don't like that Akimbo shotguns, the ones that run around like Edward Scissorhands. <laughs> I have done it a couple of times, it is fun for about 5 seconds, but that's it, people will do it all the time and I don't know where to get the fun with that, but still. There we go, where are you going? Shot in the ass. <laughs> My aim is not the best, but that's, that, that's why this, this gun's the, it's the beast. The AA-12 comes out here, it's a bit early to be pulling that out there, but still. Well, danger area here, this room here, it's hot as... This is a real hot point of the map. I'm terrible as well at stabbing at close range there because I did swap over halfway through this game to tactical. Because I, <laughs> I basically forgot about control mapping and the first part of this game, I didn't give a flying shit about kill death ratio. And what happened is I was enjoying the game in a different way, just running around, trying my thing. Then realised how poor I was at it, so I decided I'd have to try and get that back. And I went from about a 0 0.6, about 3,000, 4,000 kills behind, and I don't know, my kill death ratio is about 1.4 now, which is not great, and that's a lovely flashbang kill there. I have spent most of my time dying on this game, rushing around. I just started to pull it back now, trying to play it a little bit. I don't know, I've lost. <laughs> Lost the interest in being a dick on the game and decided that a bit more defensive is a bit more fun now. Maybe it's just a change of change of strategy, change of game, the way you play the game just makes it interesting again. Because there is lots of things that I can't use the same gun for two or three games. I have to change around, change everything around just to keep keep myself into the game and occupied. Nice triple kill there. Another Pablo. I love the Pablo because I like to keep up. If you notice, I don't stay, I don't stand still for very long. I like to keep moving. And with the Pablo, I ain't got to mess about on any laptop. So you just press your button and away you go. And let it do the work for you. A little bit of a baby buffalo zone there as well. Where you can just, as Woody's going to tag would, would, would have said. <laughs> kind of made that famous. I told it in first. <laughs> it is a hot zone, that broken doorway. I don't know what attracts people to it. Whether they just try to try and take a shortcut to people and think that they're going to cut people off. I do it myself. It's just one of them, one of them areas that you don't know why you go there, but you do. Yeah, hopefully the weekend I'll have a FIFA 11. I don't know whether anybody's into that, but who's listening? But you, yeah, it is the bomb. And it is one of my favourite or strongest parts of the game when he's playing FIFA. I'm big into my FPS games and, and football games basically. Or football game. 
since Pro Evo is just the sack of shit. Oh! He should have knifed me there. He must be having the same problem as me, remembering to press B button. Is it the hot zone again? Another guy just... <laughs> How many times have you seen that where you just run through that area and the guy just runs through at the same time? Ah, uh, 12 gets me out of the shit again. Oh, little, <laughs> little bit of a slam it into reverse there when you see the wall paint button. And we got here now, just get. So that's the medium, short, short, medium range. It got killed by the ump there, which. I hate that gun. I hate using that gun. I don't know how people do so well with the gun. I know it's really powerful, but I just think it's, it's an ugly gun as well. And we're coming to the end now. This is. That's the end of it. So it was a defeat, but. I did enjoy the I did enjoy the game. I thought it was uh, fun holding him off at that flag. I think he finished 62 and something or other and 11. Thanks for uh, watching, and I'll see you soon. Don't forget to comment, write, and subscribe.